Now this is gonna be my baby. And I don't even wanna eat it because it's so cute. Hey guys, it's Jackie Jacobson from Malibu Rescue and some of you guys know that I love to bake. So today I decided in honor of Malibu Rescue the next wave, I am gonna make a Malibu Rescue themed cake. It's super easy and it's so fun and you can decorate it any way you want to. So let's get started. your oven to 350 and you want to grease two eight inch pans these are the ones I'm using this cake is gonna be four layers so this right now is gonna make about two layers and then if you want to make four you just double the recipe I'm gonna make two white layers and then the next two I'm gonna dye blue and then I'm gonna alternate them as I stack them so when you cut into it it's gonna be blue white blue white which I think is really cute Take some softened butter, that's about one cup of butter, and this is two cups of sugar. Cream that together. You want that to be super pale and fluffy, and that is gonna give you the height. Now you're gonna slowly add in your egg whites, and this is seven egg whites. So you wanna add one at a time and make sure it's fully incorporated before you add in the next egg. The reason we are using egg whites is it's gonna make it fluffier and we're making a white cake. And if you put yolks in it, it's not gonna be white. So now that we have this really pretty fluffy batter, add a teaspoon of vanilla. Make sure all the vanilla is incorporated. So now we're gonna put this bowl aside and we are gonna slide our dry ingredient bowl. So in here, two and two thirds cup of flour, two teaspoons of baking powder. So whisk, whisk, whisk. For this, we are gonna be putting in the flour, only about a quarter of it, and then we are gonna alternate it with our one cup of milk. So a quarter of flour, combine that, and then put a little bit of milk a little bit of flour, a little bit of milk, and then end on flour as well. You can add more milk or more flour. I like my batter a little thicker, so I never use the full cup of milk, but I have it just in case or sometimes where I do need it. Now for the fun part, now that we have our batter done, we are gonna be dyeing it blue with some food coloring. So I want this to be pretty blue, so I'm gonna start off with five drops of food coloring. So one, two, three, four, five. Just mess around. You could have it a light blue. You could have it a dark blue. You can kind of do whatever you want because for the frosting, we are also gonna be dyeing that blue and we're gonna do like a darker blue and then a lighter blue. So it's gonna be like an ombre of the ocean. So now that we have our batter, you wanna make sure that you have your baking sheets lined with parchment paper on the bottom and you have sprayed them with cooking spray because you do not want those to stick to your pans in the oven. Now, we're gonna put it in the pans. So now that our pans are done, I'm gonna put those in the oven and the oven's preheated at 350. I'm gonna put them in for like 25 minutes. It could be different depending on where you are or your oven. So you just wanna stick a toothpick in them and if it comes out clear and crummy, then you are good to go. If it is still runny, leave them in there. Just make sure they don't burn. The fun part begins, which is gonna be frosting and decorating the cake. So this morning, I already made myself some just regular buttercream, which is just Melted butter, confectioner sugar, heavy whipping cream, and some vanilla. This is a white one, and this is what's gonna go in between our layers and a crumb coat. And then I made a darker blue that we're gonna put on the bottom. And then kind of a lighter blue that we are gonna put on top of that for like an ombre effect. Um, also to put on top, we have some crushed graham crackers. This is gonna be like our sand. And it cannot be a Malibu Rescue cake without Tower 2. 
little wooden tower that we are just gonna stick right on the top of the cake for decoration. All of the cakes have cooled. Here is my bottom layer. We're gonna frost them, make them look cute, and then we can eat them. So now we have finished crumb coating the cake, which is basically just a thin layer of frosting to get everything, and here is our crumb coat. It does not have to be perfect because we are gonna be putting so much more frosting on it. So here is a nice big whip of dark blue, and I am just going to place that all around the bottom. Thick band, you wanna make sure it's super thick of dark blue. And then we're gonna go in with this sky blue and do the exact same thing. Mix that around, pull it closer. Now that we have our top and our bottom done, now it's time for the super cute part. Here were the little chocolate mold. Here's a little fish. All we did was melt some white chocolate and then add food coloring, so we made those and these little turtles. And then I mixed red for these little stars. And then the shells, we kept white. Turtles are obviously my favorite as if you watch my recipe, you would know. So I'm just gonna go ahead, and I'm gonna make like a little family of turtles. I'm just gonna stick them into the frosting. And then over here, I'm gonna pop a little starfish with maybe this white pretty shell. I'm just gonna literally stick that in the cake. And you really can't go wrong with this cake because it's whatever you want it to be. It's whatever you envision the ocean to be like. Cue angel music. You guys, I think we're on to something. I think we did it. Our Malibu Rescue Tower 2 Cake. I hope you guys follow this recipe. I hope you guys love it. I hope it tastes amazing. Um, you should make it for when you watch the next Malibu Rescue, or if you want to rewatch the first one in the series, this is also an amazing snack to watch during it. Send me your take on this cake if you guys make it, and yeah, I hope you guys love it.